What's up guys, Scott Martin here, Scott Martin Challenge and professional angler on the FLW Tour. You know, I wanted to talk to you a little bit about Lithium Pro batteries. You know, I've been running the Lithium Pro systems in my bass boat and my saltwater boat for over two years now, and I've got really nothing but great things to say about this company. And uh, I want to share some of the experiences that I've had and some of the reasons why I run Lithium Pros. You know, you see lithium batteries all over the place now. You go into any hardware store, everything's lithium uh, batteries on their drills. There's lithium batteries in cell phones now. Lithium is a, is, a, is a new thing that's coming on strong in just about every aspect of anything that needs a battery. And uh, there's nothing short in the bass boat and the fishing market as well. Lithium Pros is an American-made company, and that's important to me. Uh, Kevin Bennett at Lithium Pros, he builds these batteries from scratch. He puts all the components in them himself, builds the computer boards. It's American made and that's important. These batteries are not shipped in from some other country where you're just not real sure what's going to happen. One of the other reasons that I run Lithium Pros is the weight. These things weigh hardly anything. Now this battery right here, check this out guys, is a 36 volt system. This is one battery. Now in my bass boat here behind me, what I recommend for guys that, that hardcore tournament fishermen, guys are gonna spend 12, 14 hours a day on the water, day in and day out, I recommend going with the two battery system and that's what I have in my Ranger here. I have two of these 36 volt systems hooked to a Lithium Pro DC charger that loops the extra power from my engine, extra amps, dumps it through my cranking battery and takes the extra amperage and dumps it over into my Lithium. So when I'm making those long runs like at Kentucky Lake or at Pickwick or even here on Lake Okeechobee, as I run around the lake throughout the day, I'm actually dumping extra juice back into these, these trolling motor batteries, which is great. You know, this battery, again, weighs 26 pounds. That's hard to believe, guys. When you consider that a lead core battery, you know, an AGM battery, weighs anywhere between 60 and 80 pounds. So by the time you put three lead batteries in your boat to, charge your, to work your trolling motor, you're talking 180 to 240 pounds. That's the size of a grown man. And uh, I've taken that weight out of the back of my boat. With this dual system that I have in my boat, I've got just about 50 pounds in the back of my boat total for trolling motor batteries. And I have a, a 12 volt lithium cranking battery as well. Now let me, let me touch on that just for a minute. You know, we run big graphs now on all our bass boats. Uh, everybody's got these big 10 inch units. I have multiple Garmin's on my bass boat. I'm running live wells all day long moving and grooving all day long, starting the engine. You need a lot of power. And the great thing with that 12 volt lithium, I haven't had that thing go dead one time. I'm running depth finders all day long, live wells all day long, tournament situations, and have, I've had zero problems at all. And here's why. With a lithium battery, you're getting full juice the entire cycle of that battery. Meaning that this battery does not get slow or weaken up there at the end. Like a lead battery. A lead battery, the last third of a lead battery really is pretty much useless. It's not enough, it's not enough juice to crank your battery and it's hardly enough juice to even make your trolling motor work. So that last third of a, of a trolling motor battery with a lead core um, is kind of, in my opinion, worthless. With these lithium batteries, you've got full strength up until the very end, which is great. So as I'm out there on the water, I've got all my grass running, it's giving full amperage all the way to my, to my cranking battery, starting it up, and I'm getting full amperage to my trolling motor, which gives me 100% power throughout the whole day. And that's important as much as I'm on the trolling motor. Speed. I've gained about three miles an hour here in my bass boat, and I've gained almost three miles an hour in my saltwater boat. If you're getting speed, you're getting more efficient time on the water, but you're also saving some gas. And this is, a, this is something that I've really started to notice this last year. I'm not having to put as much gas in my boat. My boat is running better. I'm not using as much gas throughout the day. And here's why. Without, without that extra weight in the back of my boat, my boat jumps up on plane really easy. Uh, it gets up on plane in, in, in just a few seconds, about a half throttle. So I'm not having to bog it down the whole time to get it up on plane to get out there. I'm saving gas that way. I'm more efficient riding around. I don't have to give it as much throttle to go the same speed as I, as I idle around the lake or even run around the lake. So I'm saving gas throughout the day. With this lightweight on the saltwater side, is it allows me to get my boat a little bit lighter, it allows my boat to float a little bit shallower, and I'm able to get back into those hard to reach places on those flats. I love to snook fish and redfish, and those extra couple inches that I can get out of my, my big bay boat helps me get into those hard to reach places. So getting that extra weight out of the back of my boat is very, very important. You know, we talk about some other things too. Let's talk about the price of these things. Yes, they're more expensive than the average AGM battery, but again, you've got three batteries packed in one. But here's how I look at it as well. I've actually been able to come up with a creative way to uh, be a little bit more economical. I have multiple boats, guys, and I'm sure a lot of you that's watching this might have a couple boats. So I have two 36-volt trolling motors. I have one on my saltwater boat, one on my bass boat. So basically, I have a two-battery kit here on my bass boat because I'm spending 12, 14 hours a day, 
seven days a week sometimes in my bass boat. But my saltwater boat, I'm not trolling motoring around as much. So guess what I've done? Here's what's so great about it. It's a 36 volt battery, guys. I just take it out of my bass boat and throw it in my saltwater boat. Hook the post to the trolling motor to the positive and negative, and I'm fishing throughout the day. And, uh, and that's a great thing. So actually, I didn't have to buy a whole new set for my saltwater boat. I've saved the money by running the dual system in my bass boat and taking this extra battery out when I need it to run it into my other boats. Now let's talk about the warranty of the Lithium Pro batteries. These batteries here behind me have a full four-year replacement. And they say they're gonna be good up for 10 years. Now I haven't run it for 10 years, but I'm fully expecting this thing to give me pure power for up to 10 years. And I'll tell you another reason why these are good is that you're, when you charge or decharge your battery halfway and you charge it back up, it does not count as a full cycle. With a lead battery, if you take a little bit off the top and recharge it, it actually recycles the battery. And a battery only has so many cycles in it. And lithium's the same way, but you get more cycles and you get a full, you don't get these half cycles that are kind of knocking away the life of the battery. So it keeps the longevity of it really well. And uh, it's just a great, great tool. You know, not only myself, but Aaron Martins is running Lithium Pros. You have Chris Lane running Lithium Pros. You have so many guys on the Elite and Bassmaster Tour and, and the FLW Tour running the Lithium Systems now because it's just a smarter thing to do. Uh, it's a good investment. And again, with the gas mileage you're going to save, over time, these batteries will pay for themselves. Matter of fact, one of my top fishing guides here at Lake Okeechobee is running Lithium Pros. Have a look at what he has to say. I'm Steve Lake. I'm a guide at Roland Martins Marina. I've been running the lithium batteries for about a year and a half. They really saved me on gas mileage on the boat. It takes 180 pounds out of the back of the boat. The boat gets up a lot quicker. Got a really good top end. These people got a good product. You need to check it out. The people will take care of you. I tell you what, if Steve is saving money, you can too. And uh, it's something that most fishing guides really pay a lot of attention to. So for Steve to give these batteries a vote of confidence is, uh, is a really good thing. So if you're looking for a new battery system for your boat, uh, you want to be able to go uh, a little bit faster. You want a little bit more performance out of your bass boat or your saltwater boat. You want to have a little bit more time on the water. You want to have a quicker charge time. Uh, you just want to have something that's just really cool. Check out Lithium Pros. Uh, it'll be one of the best investments you've made. We'll see you guys.